Hey guys, today I'm going to be talking about um, how my new internet speeds have basically, you know, kickstarted my YouTube channel again because I've had previous channels before, you know, I've had Duran Duran, which was um, quite successful, it was partnered, uh, and it's, you know, it was doing well. It's just that because of my upload speeds at the time, you know, it would take about five six hours to upload a video that was maybe 10 minutes long and HD you know and it was a size about what 300 400 megabytes and it just took ages you know and then that just made it a whole lot of hassle because it meant that I had a lot more work to do I had to make sure the video uploaded well and if it didn't upload you know I had to re-upload it which means that you know if I plan to upload it say on a Monday it could come out on a Tuesday and if not on a Tuesday it could come out on the latest on a Wednesday so you know it kind of affected what I wanted to do and what I could do because of the upload speeds now with this new internet I've got, I've got BT Infinity my upload speeds are now a lot faster you know I can upload a video now same sort of size you know a video like this in about 10 minutes and it's processed and it's HD and it's done and it's, it just makes me want to upload more it's you know like some support, some you know, help to for my channel because before it was a bit more of a hassle. I had to, you know, leave it going for ages. I couldn't use my computer while it was uploading. I couldn't use the internet while it was uploading because it would just take a lot of time. I had uh, an internet usage cap of about 40 gigabytes, so I could only upload so much a month, um, just so I didn't go over the usage cap. So I had to spend more money. Um, but now I'm on unlimited, so I can upload and use the internet however much I want to. You know, I can live stream now, which I couldn't do before. And I will be doing as the channel grows, you know, when more people want to see that. It's just a very good thing to have if you want to, you know, start a YouTube channel and hopefully, you know, go through with it. Because without it, you're limited to what you can do, you know, you can only do about a couple of videos a week um, and it would take ages and I was getting pixelation on my other videos as well I think it would probably do to um, connection being interrupted while I was uploading and I just put some motion blur on some of the videos and it just takes down the quality quite a lot people don't particularly want to see that if they see that they might go off because it was ruining the videos it was so in some cases when it was really bad it was going across you know the whole screen um, for a good three four seconds and it just ruins the video um, and then I would try uploading again and if it happens again then that's you know a good two days spent trying to upload a video and it's technically you know crap so that's pretty bad so having a good internet is a good thing also just quickly going into this gameplay this is a old I think ground war TDM gameplay uh, 25 to 3 using the um, overkill with the DSR and the PDW 57 um, using the stealth chopper. Um, I don't know why I was using stealth chopper because it kind of doesn't really do much. Um, orbital visa and a Vito warship. Now, I, I don't know, I, I prefer to use a load star to the Vito warship because I can just seem to get a lot more kills. Um, it's easier to get as well, you know, you lose less score. And I think the Vito warship just gets taken down too quickly. It's a lot harder to use, you know, you've got to move it into position. You've got the rockets and that to use, and as well as the main gun. And look, it's already been taken down, and I've got what, three, four kills, if that. Whereas low style, you can just get doubles and triples, and you can just, you know, just spawn trap them, as it were. But this was a fairly good quick gameplay, you know, we win 100 to about 48, I think. So they couldn't even get um, half the score. So yeah, it was a pretty fast win. So thanks for watching this video, guys. You know, check out the other stuff. You know, I'll be uploading some more Crisis 3 as well. I'll start uploading the Crisis 3 walkthrough series. Um, I'll be uploading another commentary probably tomorrow, and that'll be another Call of Duty one. Um, probably be a couple of the Double Swarm gameplay. Um, I'm yet to get a nuclear. I've got very close a number of times. I think I've had about six or seven 25 tries. Um, you know, it's 30 for a nuclear, so I'm yet to get one of them. 
Um, I'll probably get one of them soon, you know, if I keep playing, but I'm trying to do some more Crisis as well. As well as I start doing the retro game series, so I'm looking into what games I can possibly get um, for that. Someone suggested Battlefront 2, how it's just Star Wars. If I was to do that, I'd probably have to download it off Steam and then record it on PC, as it was only um, PlayStation 2. I don't think it was on Xbox. Um, I can check, but I'm pretty sure it was PlayStation only and PC only. Um, so thanks for watching, you know, check out the other videos. Social Nova Network will be going up soon, I believe, uh, with content up there. I'll be having some videos up there as well. So see you soon, guys, probably either later on today with a crisis video or tomorrow. So bye, guys. Have fun.